We got a brand new juicy deal on MrMuckCoin.com. Use code DOUBLE and we will double anything that you order on the site for the next 24 hours. So go on over to the link in my bio and get yourself a deal. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a brand new video. Today, we got some interesting news to talk about in Madden Mobile. And first off, before we get into the video, I want to apologize. I'm extremely sick right now. I don't know what it is, but I just feel like trash. So I'm going to still try and get videos out. But yo, big news in Madden Mobile so far today. And also, I want to address the fact that my Instagram actually got disabled. So somebody report botted my Instagram. So they like put a bot and just reported me for spam for like hours. And it took down my Instagram. So my my current alternate right now is at Mobile Thick on Instagram. So go hit that up right now with the follow. If possible, just go comment or whatever. But be sure to follow that right now for all my news and all that stuff. And also you can follow me on Twitter at MMSlate. Additionally, huge shout out to SquadQL again for sponsoring the video. If you guys play fantasy football, this app is for you. SquadQL, basically you can manage multiple leagues hosted by different websites. And what's dope about this app is that it has an optimize your lineup feature, which sets the best fantasy football players for your lineup. It's a free app. There's a link in the description. I use this every day. Be sure to check out this insane tool. But let's go ahead and get into the news. We got some pretty wild stuff going on in Battle Mobile right now. And if you guys haven't seen, first off, Jerry Rice is now back in packs. So a correction from a previous video, the GOAT promo is going to end Monday. So if you have like Deion Sanders, these wild cards that are like only available for one day, hold on to the cards because you're going to be able to sell them for much more when they become a rarity on the auction house. Now, additionally, we got some sort of notification from EA talking about Hurricane Irma, dog. This is absolutely wild. First off, it's just this big, like, red kind of warning Hurricane logo, and it says, if Hurricane Irma hits the EA to Burrod offices in Orlando, Florida, there may be an interruption in the Madden NFL service. While we recover from the storm's effects, our apologies and stay safe. In case you guys weren't aware, EA headquarters is based out of Tiburon in Orlando. That's where everything basically happens, and the storm's path for Hurricane Irma is potentially projected to go somewhere into Florida. I'm praying that it hits, you know, the Northeast and goes back out to the Atlantic, but it's definitely in path to hit Florida by freaking Sunday. So right now, today is Friday. So first off, I am praying for all of you guys in Florida. Please, you guys have all my prayers. Please stay safe, homies. Don't get, like... Take all the necessary precautions. I'm sure you guys are. But, yo, that's freaking wild. The fact that Madden Mobile can get shut down by Hurricane Irma. And, and I just want to make it clear that this is not nearly as important as your safety. So, if you live in Florida, like, if you need anything, please, like, contact me. Like, I want to make sure you guys are, like, legit safe. Please don't get hurt. Um, I'm I'm legit just praying that the, that the hurricane just completely, you know, moves away from Florida. I was in Florida recently. I have family in Florida. So hopefully you guys are safe. But yeah, Madden Mobile could shut down as well if Hurricane Irma just wrecks the EA headquarters. Um, so that would be a thick rip. So as of now, um, I think they're actually evacuating people from the EA headquarters. So Madden Mobile is kind of like on its own. It's just the server. It's going live. If, you know, if the headquarters gets wrecked, then the game shuts down alongside with the headquarters. Um, so it's it's terrible. Like, literally, Hurricane Irma would shut down EA headquarters, and that would suck for a lot of EA games, and it would be a huge loss of revenue for them. So prayers out to EA. I mean, I don't. this is probably the first time that I'm praying for EA, but, you know, EA, stay safe. Um, developers, please, be, like, get out of there. Actually stay safe um, because you do make a game that we actually enjoy playing, even though, you know, there's a few changes that you can make. But, yeah, this is wild. Hurricane Irma, dude, just going to slide into EA's DMs. So, basically, what's going to happen is if EA gets hit with Hurricane Irma, they're going to have to recover from the storm's effects to get the game back going. So, we could even see, in a worst-case scenario, Madden Mobile being shut down for one to two months, which would be absolutely outrageous. But again, this is just a game. In other news, Jerry Rice is in Madden Mobile right now for all the different bundles. Now, of course, scheduled is Bo Jackson and other players to come in the future days. But again, with the offices kind of being skeptical, especially come Sunday when the hurricane is suspected to slide up into Florida, then you could see a potential of like these packs not coming out. What would happen to the market at this time, I think, if the game 
stream was to potentially shut down, or let's say the GOAT promo was canceled because of the hurricane, you'd have like guys like Deion Sanders and Jerry Rice probably double in their auction house price just because, first off, they're a rarity because you can only get them from a bundle or from like you know, a really like lucky pull for 24 hours. Then after that, it's not existent. You can't get any more of those cards. So they will be, you know, jumping up in price. So I would hold on if you do have them. Most people don't. You're probably going to be experiencing pop ups of the news. So like when you log into Madden Mobile, you might keep seeing the news pop up on your Madden Mobile. That's just a glitch that they can't really fix right now because I think they're actually evacuating the EA headquarters. So any sort of like glitches or logistics could go on. Hopefully, nobody like hacks the game while EA is gone. And it just becomes a complete crap show and everyone is just like oh billions of coins but hopefully you guys are doing well um i'm i'm feeling extremely sick right now i'm trying to get better for you guys for some more videos um but thank you so much for subscribing remember to subscribe uh we had a lot of people enter the contest yesterday for the million coin giveaway be sure to check out that video that was a really fun video um uh, but half the people didn't subscribe which sucks for them because they won't be entered into the giveaway even though they did all the you know the comment and like it but if you don't subscribe you're not in it so thank you guys so much for watching the video be sure to hit that like button. Follow me on my new alternate account at Thick with two C's on Instagram. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, homies.